When this man met a wolf trapped alone in the woods, he did what most people would never dare to. Before we continue with the rest of the video, we could use your help. Click that like button to help spread the word about Watch Jojo, and also be sure to subscribe and click the notification bell so you don't miss our future videos. With one of his paws locked in a trap, this beautiful yet potentially dangerous timber wolf is stuck and going nowhere fast. And while the animal appears relatively calm, his rapidly beating chest suggests that he's in major distress. Then when a man brandishing a gun appears, it looks like the worst is about to happen. The scene described comes from a YouTube video that was uploaded in late 2015, and the man in question is John Owens, a trapper from Wisconsin. But as Owens starts narrating the video, it's not entirely obvious what he's planning to do next. There's also the related question, has he captured the wolf on purpose? Aside from some domestic dog breeds, timber wolves, also known as grey or common wolves, are the biggest members of the Canidae biological family. This group is made up of wolves, jackals, foxes, domestic dogs and other dog-like mammals. Before we continue with the rest of the video, we could use your help. Click that like button to help spread the word about Watch Jojo and also be sure to subscribe and click the notification bell so you don't miss our future videos. It's thought that the breed evolved one million years back in Eurasia and that the wolves then made their way over to the United States approximately 750,000 years ago. Timber wolves can grow to quite a size too. Adults can reach up to five and a quarter feet in length and weigh in at almost 80 pounds. The timber wolf has an incredibly thick protective coat and its paws are also specially designed to deal with cold climates such as that of Wisconsin. These animals therefore boast extra fur in between their toes while their paws are supersized too with elongated claws perfect for high speed running. And so the beautiful creature that has its paw trapped must have been pretty worried about the prospect of losing it, given just how important these specially adapted body parts are to his survival. Luckily, however, John Owens had in fact turned up to try to set the wolf free from the trap. Why? Because the wolf had wandered into the trap by accident. Owens had actually laid the trap for coyotes, so when he found a wolf caught in the device one morning, he knew there was only one thing to do. Somehow he was going to have to set the animal free. Luckily, Owens decided to capture this whole process on video. Pictured alongside the wolf, he explains, This is my first timber wolf of 2015. It's a big, beautiful animal. I'm going to go ahead and get out of the trap and get him on his way. Next, the camera pans around to introduce two other men who have arrived at the scene to assist Owens with the release. However, they don't seem totally convinced that the trapped animal is actually a wolf. Really, it's just a big coyote, John. There ain't nothing to him, says the first man. And the other guy adds, It ain't no wolf, that's a coyote. Hmm, easy for them to say, perhaps especially since they're not the ones about to risk their necks by coming face to face with the animal to set him free. Anyway, ignoring his friend's comments, Owens edges closer. Then brandishing a rectangular piece of plywood for protection, he approaches the animal. His plan is simple yet clever. He's made a hole in the bottom of the wood, which he then places over the wolf's trapped leg. First, the wolf jolts back, seemingly panicked by Owens' maneuver. He snaps defensively at the wood with his jaws, attempting to get to his paw. Instinctively, the animal fights against Owens. After all, the creature may need help, but he's surely terrified of the situation and the gun-toting humans surrounding him. Luckily, after a few seconds, the wolf calms down. It seems that Owen's piece of plywood has a bit of inspired thinking. It hides him from the animal so as to not scare him so much, and at the same time, it shields him from a potential attack. One of the men points a rifle directly at the wolf and says, He's watching me. He's totally watching me. This acts as a cue for Owens to start the rescue attempt. And with the GoPro attached to his helmet, he captures the whole attempt from another angle, but will it be successful? With the wolf safely on one side of the plywood, Owen sets to work on opening the trap. And while you might assume that he'd need a special device to do so, in fact, he pulls at the trap using only his hands. In any event, Owen's improvised technique is a success. With his paw released, the wolf leaps back before running off into the dense woodland behind, no doubt eager to get back to the rest of his pack. Plus, it appears that the animal has escaped from his ordeal completely unharmed. Owen's brave and utterly cool approach to the trapped wolf has won him plenty of fans. Indeed, over 7 million people have watched the video on YouTube so far. One commenter wrote, Wow, that piece of plywood was 10 times quicker and more effective than the people who release using catch poles. Good job. Another meanwhile wrote, Damn, dude, you made that look easy. The fact that the wolf was safely released is obviously great news for the animal, but it also comes as something of a relief for Owen's. That's because in 2014, a year before the incident, Wolves found in Wisconsin were legally classified as endangered 
and so they could not be poached. This rule is, furthermore, still in place today, although there are many in the state who want it reversed. In fact, poaching for wolves in Wisconsin is a controversial topic with a long history of legislative changes. In 2012, for example, only two years previous to the latest endangered law being passed, the state legalized wolf hunting in an attempt to control pack numbers. During those three seasons of legal hunting, almost 530 wolves were recorded as having been killed by hunters. Numbers have now recovered, however. In fact, the most recent figures put the Wisconsin wolf population at close to 900, a record amount. And thanks to Owen's handiwork, we can add his safely released canine friend to that number. Please don't forget to share this video with your friends below. Please don't forget to subscribe and activate the bell to receive everything that's new.